FXB ICOM have announced the new ICOM ID 5200 to replace the 5100 and yes they've given us a colour screen and we have to say thank you ICOM for producing such fantastic devices. Now I'm having a, a nice close look here and they have really packed a lot into this new model. If we look here at the top, okay, starting from the left there, you've got GPS, Vox, I can see Bluetooth, USB com. So there's going to be a USB connection to this, Wi-Fi, SD card. And if we just scroll to the bottom here, look at that icon at the bottom. That is for photographs, that's for sending photographs. Independent VFOs on both sides here, independent volume control. I know it's a bit blurry, but on the top left and the uh, the top right, then you've got your dial, independent channel chain. So it is very, very similar uh, to the 5100. Remember, the 5100 has that nice, very large screen. And what size is this? You know, it looks to me at least five, five inches, I would say, maybe more. Uh, so uh, looking forward to this now, there, there isn't a date announced, but my guess is this is going to be a, a my, and it is a complete guess, a summer radio. You've got DR mode. It's going to do airband, VHF, UHF. I know in the USA, you're going to be saying we also want 220. And look at this. It's also got TNC. I'm not sure we can see it there just above the frequency you've got 144640 KISS 96 now the 96 is going to stand for the board rate so 9600 possibly I would say you're going to be able to select 1200 memory channels there's an SD card slot there so you can import your memory channels just like you can with your ICOM 52 ICOM 705 so uh, for me it's a winner and my guess again is 50 watt radio and you'll probably get 50 watts on 70 sems the kiss one's interesting because icom always did dprs now when you start to see kiss now i'm wondering if they're going to do uh, the normal aprs so yeah looking forward to it and price wise what do we think mm, i got a feeling it's this one's going to be a, and i think it's good value i think it's going to be eight nine hundred pound and that's my guess the 7300 Mark II, I reckon that's going to be looking at £1,300. So thanks to ICOM, thanks so much, and uh, yeah, nice little preview here. Bye for now, 7.3, all the best.